Hey there guys, girls, goblins and other nasties, and welcome to FTL, or Faster Than Light. It is a very painful game to play. It, you are, part, are, I think, part of the Republic, or some federation in space, uh, trying to get some intel from the rebels. For once, the rebels are the bad guys. Why well, are we the bad guys? Hmm. We'll find out. Uh, yeah, pretty much this is from A to B with a lot of hell in between. Uh, we have a small crew and very, very little life. It's like Dark Souls on acid. I should say that. Let's go. Uh, just so you know, I have no idea how to play this game or if I'm even playing it correctly, but hey, hey. hey. I don't want to name them because I don't want to lose anything. But we'll start with the normal ship, the Kestrel. Let's go. The data you'll carry is vital to the remaining Federation fleet. You'll need supplies for the, your journey, so make sure to explore each sector before moving on to the next. But to get to, get to the exit before the pursuing rebel fleet can catch up. Tip: sensors and ship goes. No, we just fix it. Okay, okay. We just need to do that. Yeah, the main thing we need to actually worry about is power. See, uh, we have very limited power. Uh, I've played it, played it, this game somewhat. The highest I got to was Sector 5, which I think is about 10, so, so I'm not sure. Either way, I'm not prepared for this game. Uh, keep, this, keep these guys where they are. Fortunately, we have a pause button. mistake already. So I don't think I can jump from here all the way to the other end of the system. Or sector, sector over here. The captain of the ship claims he can provide services as long as you've got the scrap. Hire the mercenary to delay the rebels. Hire the mercenary to scout. Oh, I don't have much money. Okay. Uh, should we fight the ship? Yeah, I'm feeling suicidal. Mercenaries are worse than rebels. The only honourable course is to engage the mercenary in battle. Continue. Okay, okay, okay. Um, I like to go for the shields and oxygen first. Because... I'm suffocating, <laughs> I guess. Okay, um, just need to be careful. Make sure I don't die. Is it good? Yep. Why did I start this fight? Like, I, I could have just scooted on by. Let those guys commit crimes and whatever. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, I think I did this. Um, maybe I should go for the engines. Sweating. <laughs> Will never be me. Uh, the ship explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap material. Uh, I'd say this is very beneficial. Okay, everyone heal up. <laughs> uh, here's the 
points damage. Look. I think it went, went well, our first encounter. But the f but hey. <laughs> uh. no, I just know this is just going to kill us anyway. I have a strange fascination, fascination with um, being in pain in games. <laughs> like, my idea of a good time is Dark Souls. Yeah, I don't think I couldn't jump there. It actually cut through there, which is, it actually cuts the stops the, um, the rebels catching up closer, faster. You know, because there's a certain time limit we have to spend in each, each system. So yeah, that can uh, I don't really see them, so it's fine. So we go here. There. You know, I might find more more resources, you know. We, should, we need everything we can get. You barely have time to register jump completion for your ship orange of an incoming ship with what is hot. Maybe we can upgrade a power later. Is there any benefit to him then? Pass the recharge. 
Elizabeth Dodge. Fast charge. Okay. Hopefully we can find another crewmate. So we can have all three systems. So. Okay, go, go into the... Uh, should we... You jump into the middle of a plasma storm. Multiple recently inca incapacitated ships that loom in the shadows. Briefly illuminated by the lightning. Manually search the wreckage for survivors and equipment. Avoid the risk of not to jump in. Ah, uh, sure. Ooh, ooh, I love guns. Most of the debris is hardly u even usable as scrap. However, you eventually find an intact weapon that can be mounted to your ship. Cool, 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 cool. I love the idea of that. Not enough power. Okay, we just need to jump, to jump out of it. Shields are down and we're going last long. Oh, but that's gonna. Sure. You try your best, but one stray rock hits a key structure in their sh ship and breaks apart in front of your eyes. You'll salvage what you can before you leave Trying to think about the lost crew.
Batista. Okay. Where's Maxim? Hey Maxim, Milius. Good to shoot. Is there like a perk to each species? Which is the way to leave. We 
spot a small rail ship nearby. It seems to have been refitted for transport rather than combat. It does not seem to want to engage you or your ship. Demand the surrender of their goods. Okay. You prepare this to secure the cargo by force. Okay. Source of the distress beacon. A small research station appears. It appears a small laboratory fire had got out of control and is threatening to destroy the entire station. The fire suppression system is not responding. Okay, let's try to rescue survivors. That sh we should not have done that. Well, we should not have done that. <laughs> you locate the highest concentration of the life forms and bring the lot ship alongside the station. Before you can bring begin the offload of the survivors. A huge blast splits the station apart. Your ship is thrown away and some debris pierces your hull. You watch helplessly as the last of the survivors are consumed in the, in the collapse of the station. We really shouldn't have done that. On the right side. Come on. 
the Vulcan. I don't know if you came across, but I have no idea how to play this game. Back to where we started. Yeah, can we build a ship here? There is only one other ship in the this beacon, and it appears and it's showing heavy damage. You receive a message on your, on your console. Greetings, traveller. We were crippled by a band of pirates and are now forced to sell our remaining valuable equipment to acquire the necessary supplies to get home. Side, it will take a while for the rebel fleet to catch up. On the other side, I might die. The rebel ship in the nebula ahead, and you spot a rebel ship in the nebula ahead and stay off their ra radar. Try to gauge. Nope. You, uh, you doubt they spot this. The foot said they saw you. Whew. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna fight. I'm not gonna choose to fight. I don't even think we have enough hyper jace. Have a hyper jump thingy. You feel naked without functioning sensors. You half expect a ripple ship to appear from, from behind one a cloud at any moment, but no, none come. Yeah, I don't. I don't think we have enough, unless we find one right now. Which I doubt. <laughs> I'm not really going to be lost here. You see a set of civilian space station with heavy damage. You receive a message. We've been hit hard by the war. We need more drone parts to speed up our repairs. We'll buy some from you if you have extra. Have, have extra. I wish I could hold the hold the drone right now. Get all station. Okay. Distress. Uh, seems the other way. Maybe I should have bought some. You find a number of ships fleeing from a small space station. You've hailed them, asking what's wrong. 
Help! We're being overrun by some sort of giant alien spiders. You send the crew to help? I don't like spiders in general, but not alien spiders. No, but not Papoku! Pivaluk! Not Pivaluk! I like Pivaluk! Your crew boards the station and cautiously moving between them, cor mo moving between corridors. Suddenly, a man-sized arachnid bursts from a vent into in the ceiling, followed by countless more. You fight your way back to the airlock and are forced to leave before accounting for for all crewmates. Not everyone made it back. Not Pivaluk. Pivaluk. I like him. Oh, well, then. One heck of a pilot. <laughs> Maxim, please learn fast. Okay. Can I, can I buy it? No, I can't. <laughs> oh dear. We're not gonna survive. This is the last it. This is it. This is it. A pawnbroker has set up a shop at this obscure beacon. He might be offering something worth looking at. I'm gonna die. Oh. The, the prolonged wait in the interview phase has caused the tension between Mungo Crow still no contact. Oh shit. Just turn on the beacon. Ah! The man's ship hails you. Looks like we found the poor fools poor that need some help. Come, brothers, let's help. I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Okay, okay. We'll make this. Make it count. <gasps> no, I didn't see that guy. Okay, the ship's blade will be my hand protection. I'm using scrap. Cool. Cool. Okay.
thing is, I don't think two is going to cut it. Johnson will be the pilot. We will go goes back to because I think we just we're gonna need dodges. We need, need a dodge. <laughs> that worked out. Oh, this is not even the final one, is it? That was terrible. Please be kind to me. <laughs> Long range beacon is almost hidden within the nebula. When the FTO dry, dry okay. please be kind. Oh, thank fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> we to the new sector. Get the, to get to the exit beacon and jump to the next sector before the pursuing weapons catch up. Can we just take a moment and appreciate our oh, survival skills? No store. I, uh, we can't deal with a fight and I don't want to risk that not, not incident with a fire. Okay. Refinery and 
several factories are all standing still and empty, no life stones are detected. I'm gonna die. Please, 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 please. I should have bought bought more. I should have bought more. Oh no, 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 no. This is gonna come. A mobile slug man fuel depot is a scanning range. My prices are fair, but I ask one thing. Do not insult me with negotiation. You check out this, but it's price list. Please. Appreciate it. You're for more reasonable price, but the slug man is outraged. He moves into a dagger. I should have paid pay for the robot. I'm Darwin. Oh, this is it. 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 Need your shields. I can't let them let fall. Oh, it had to be ion, didn't it? It just had to be ion. Wait, we can't even escape, can we? Baby bites are still bites. That was not a bite, that was a chunk. Bye-bye.